number three on the year in 260 attempts. Let's see what Georgia does offensively. They'll stay on the ground on the first play. Johnson just one pick. That came two weeks ago against South Carolina. After the eight-yard pickup, second down and two. They'll keep it with Zamir Wright. He'll be tripped up close to the line to gain. Fresh set of downs for Georgia. Stay on the ground. They'll give it to White. Breaks a tackle. Gets it inside the 10 down to around the 6. Second down and 3. Again on the ground. They'll give it to White. Working that left side of that line. And he'll get it to the 4th. Sixth play of this drive. They've all been on the ground. You can keep it on the ground here. McIntosh with that little pitch and a touchdown for Georgia. Georgia Bulldogs sitting just outside their own 10-yard line, leading by a touchdown. JT Daniels has yet to throw as Georgia continues to run it. This time, Kenny McIntosh. Georgia going a little tempo. I think maybe Arkansas exposed Missouri in that up-tempo last week. Georgia might try to step on the gas a little bit more this week than they normally do as George Pickens makes that reception. He is an air raid, but it is not the Kendall Bryles air raid by any stretch of the imagination. There is a tempo effect to this offense, but... They'll keep it on the ground here as James Cook gets that carry. Nine have been on the ground. They'll stay that way on this handoff. Broken tackle by Cook. The limit right now for Missouri. Jermaine Burton comes in motion. First down and ten. Again, Georgia staying on the ground. White bounces off one Tiger. The same because that's what this defense needs out of him for them to be successful. Burton on the catch. A couple of yards as he falls forward. That's just third downs. <laughs> Clean pocket. Nice catch by Cook. He's to the 15, to the 10, 5. Touchdown, Georgia. It's things that your team builds on. You want at least some kind of home field advantage. Georgia trying to take that away as JT Daniels goes up top. They're going to say that Pickens makes the catch. They'll toss it to Zamir White. He is tripped up. JT getting some heat, throws. Passes overthrown. Missouri's playing tons of man coverage. Georgia receivers have to win. Pocket collapses, Daniels goes down. Well, Georgia will go first and ten, couple of tight ends. They will hand it off inside. That will go to Kenny McIntosh, who's getting a lot of work today. They'll swing it near side. McIntosh, first down and more. And a big collision around the 45. They'll spot him right there. They just beat him out to the corner and out leverage the defender. Defensively for Missouri, had a career-high five stops last week. Handoff, McIntosh to midfield, driving a couple of guys with him close to the line to gain. Give him 13, it'll be third down and one. McIntosh trying to get that line. He needs to get to the 45. Missouri bringing some heat. Daniels going up top on first down, and no one is there. He's got an opportunity at the top. Comes some heat again. Daniels hit as he throws, incomplete. They were trying to go that way, shock to Pickens. Georgia hasn't thrown it a bunch today. This is just their ninth attempt through the air. That one's incomplete. James Cook on Nick Bolton at the bottom. Daniels going deep. Burton comes into the formation. Pre pressure comes. Daniels popped as he throws it. Incomplete trying to hit Burton. Trey McKitty, the tight end, splits into the slot. Quick throw. That one's batted down at the line of scrimmage.
Daniels throws on the run and pass is caught first down Georgia. Pass caught right at the first down line by Burton. Missouri bringing some heat. Daniels hit as he throws. Lofts it straight up in the air. A flag comes down, but the catch is made. George Pickens with the grab in the end zone on the 50-50 ball. Third down conversion is in the first half. They'll keep it on the ground here and hand it off to Zamir White. A nice seven-yard gain to start things off. <laughs> They're telling you, you're throwing it down the field. The dudes are making plays for you. Hand it off again to Zamir White. Big hole left side to midfield to the 40. Run out of bounds. Now on the ground for White. Two tight end set for the Bulldogs on first down and 10. It's the same Missouri team in Athens. Oh, wow. JT Daniels to the end zone and Pickens on third down and 10. Looks like they've settled in. Six on the line of scrimmage. They'll bring five of those guys. Quick slam. Pickens catch. First down. Touchdown, Georgia. I think coming to this ball game, Stetson Bennett, who was the guy, had eight. JT, a little bootleg, drops it off to Burton. Stutter steps. And he's going to be just shy of the line to gain, so give him nine and a half. Demetrius Robertson in motion. Here goes Kenny McIntosh. Nice little stutter step. Frees him up on the near side, and he'll be pushed out of bounds in Missouri territory. JT Daniels slings it over the middle. It's incomplete. Wednesday, Thursday, there might be some snow here in Como. There is some Zamir White. That'll be a touchdown, Georgia. And you find a big catch for your tight end. Daniels will go up top again. And that one is incomplete of ability. It can be that type of player, but just has to learn what it takes to be successful in the SEC. JT Daniels to the end zone. This one is knocked away. Sawyer, Schaefer, Ben Cleveland, Warren McClendon. They'll work the right side now with Cook. Touchdown, Georgia. They should throw it around a lot. Little toss sweep going to James Cook. Or be successful versus Missouri, and they've been able to run it and throw it. Handoff goes to McIntosh. Bounces it to the outside. They'll fake it to Edwards. JT Daniels passes caught. Washington over the middle using that trick in that sense. You call that, I'll find you a completion. Jameis Winston, on the other hand, when he was at Tampa, would just say, I got it. So I think they put him in at the right time when he was ready to go. Here's Edwards on this carry. 14 apiece. Georgia going to try to get one more playoff here, it looks like. JT Daniels says, yeah, I'll sling it one more time. And there is Pickens again. Are you kidding me? The kind of day he's had, his catches have not been easy. Daniels to the end zone, lofts it up in the air, and that one is incomplete, trying to hit Darnell Washington.